Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are once again back on Red Dead Redemption 2, and I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to kill the legendary Tatanka Bison. This guy is an absolute unit, just like his friend, the legendary White Bison that we found on the north end of the map. This guy is just as big, just as difficult to kill. Uh, he is a little bit more challenging to find, for he's got a bunch of bushes and trees that he's hiding in, unlike the White Bison that was out in the open uh, with just a few snow covered trees protecting him. Uh, like I said, this guy's a little bit more of a challenge to find, but once you find him, you should be able to take him out pretty easily. So let's go ahead and talk about where you're going to find this dude. This dude is located in New Austin, just north of the San Luis River. As you guys will see, he is on this little track that is just northwest of Manteca Falls. Uh, if you guys zoom in, if you follow this little track, Follow the track, you'll end up finding the first clue. It's going to pop up and tell you that, hey, you're in the area of a legendary animal. Check your thing. You'll find the first clue, which is in the middle of the pasture. It's fairly close to one of the big trees. Just look around, you'll see it. It's out in the open. There's not a lot guarding uh, the clues in this area. It's just a big open field. Uh, so once you find that first clue, it's going to be bison dung there in the middle of the pasture. The second clue is going to be straight ahead behind the giant group of bushes. You guys will see there are a bunch of bushes. The second clue is going to be behind them on the back end. There are a bunch of broken sticks there. Once you search that, it's going to give you your third clue, which is, again, straight ahead in, in the pasture just before you get to the group of trees. You guys will see another pretty open area to find the clue. Not very hidden. But once you get to that third clue, once you search it, the bison will spawn. He's going to spawn in the group of trees and bushes that's to your left. You guys will see there's a giant area there with a bunch of trees and bushes that's very difficult to see inside of. He's going to spawn in that area. You do want to be careful. If you move too quickly and try to get in there, he's going to get spooked and run away or attack you. So what I did was I crouched around, I moved around throughout the bushes until he got in a spot where I felt comfortable. And it only took me five shots to take this guy out with my rifle to the head. He was a little bit easier to kill uh, than the white bison. It might have been because I was a little bit closer, I'm not sure. It's probably going to take you guys five or six shots to take this guy out anyways if you're shooting at the head with a rifle. But again, guys, I would highly recommend being very, very careful when trying to take this dude out. It's very easy for him to blend in, in the bushes and the trees, and especially using them as cover. You might end up missing a shot, giving this chance, uh, giving this guy a chance to get away, which obviously you don't want to do. But anyway, guys, that's really the video. This is how you track and kill the legendary Tatanka Bison. If you guys have any questions, maybe you're having trouble finding this guy or taking him out, make sure to leave him down in the comment section below. I'll be happy to help some of you guys out. Uh, like I said, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Can we be friends?